Okay, what's up? We are at Civil Society. Damn. I am. <laughs> what's up? We are at Civil Society Brewery here in Jupiter, Florida, here in Abacoa, which is in Jupiter, for those who don't know. That's like the main strip. Uh, a lot of fun, a lot of party action going on. Spent a lot of time here, spent a lot of time across the street, going back and forth. Um, love this place. Drank a lot of beers here. But uh, here to show you one of my favorite spots in town and here to answer 21 questions for y'all. And so y'all get to know me. <laughs> so y'all get to know me a little bit better. Uh, so check it out, enjoy it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, have some fun with us. I wanna see you answer the 21 questions in the comments. So answer those questions. Let's drink. <laughs> I got an order for me and all my friends here today. So I'm gonna get a fresh, a pontoon cruise, the sunshine state of mind, and the pulp, please. And we'll all enjoy it together, right guys? So we're gonna play 21 questions, and every time I answer a question, I'm gonna sip a beer. I got four beers here right now. Probably a little lit by the end of this. Let's have some fun. What type of food do I like? I'm gonna say my favorite food is either steak, or lately I've been eating a lot of sushi, but steak's definitely my thing. I like to make my own steaks or have my little brother Ryan make me my steaks, but steak or sushi for sure. Now let's drink. Actually, another one I can't live without, pizza. Love me some damn pizza. But I have to stay away from it. Well, so it depends. Big hip hop guy, right? So when I'm working out, getting up in the morning, it's always hip hop. Uh, after my workout though, I go to some R&B to kind of chill me out, cool me off. Uh, sometimes like when I'm cooking, I gotta listen to like, some Jack Johnson, some Dave Matthews, man, stuff like that. And then like sometimes when I'm alone and I'm driving, Put on some country, you know, listen to some country a little bit. So I'm kind of diverse in my music, but uh, I'd say overall though, listen to hip hop the most. Uh, my favorite artists, people like Kid Leroy, Juice World, 24K Golden, you know, the baby, Lil Baby. And uh, when it comes to R&B, <clears throat> you know, I think the goats are like Usher, uh, Boys the Men, Genuine, Casey and JoJo, you know, Luther Vandross. So yeah, like, those are my guys. Country, big Easton Corbin guy. I uh, love him, love Jake Owen. He's a local Florida boy, so you gotta represent. So yeah, I, you know, I like it all. But now it's time to sip. Uh, I would probably take that money and reinvest it into property, land, and start building more houses. My goal is to build houses. I wanna be a construction guy. I wanna, you know, I got my GC license. You know, I just bought some land. I bought two pieces of land. I got a third one right now and I'm gonna turn those into houses. So if I got a million dollars, go buy more land, go build more houses, and turn that million dollars into hopefully four or five million dollars and keep doing the same thing and keep that nut growing. That's what I do. What about you? Comment below. Do I like pets? Yes. Big dog guy. I like big dogs. Uh, I got my dog Harley, which a lot of you have seen already. That's my baby girl. Um, I have a cat at the house too, which she's actually growing on me. I, you know, used to not be into cats and all, but I'm taking over my little brother's cat, Phoebe. She's like a dog though, that's probably why I like her. Most cats I don't like, but that's the cat I do like. Um, I don't like the cat ladies that are on Facebook and Instagram that are just coming at my neck all the time. I catch you with your cats and I call you out. I ain't worried about y'all. I'm a drink. My dream job, my dream job is to be a high school football coach. I wanna, my goal is by 40 years old to stop everything I'm doing. Uh, maybe be a shot caller for my businesses, but that's it. Like just yes, no things, but I wanna be a high school football coach. I wanna be a high school football coach and I wanna be a dad. Those are the two things I wanna do in my life. Uh, so, you know, I wanna be able to stop everything I'm doing, help kids get to college, and then also focus on my kids. Co be a high school football coach, you coach from like three to six, so I get all those time to spend with my kids, do whatever, and then coach football. That's my goal. So dream job, be a dad, be a high school football coach. Oh shit, I got a drink. Back over here. My 
my favorite hobby. Oh, that's a tough one. I'd say my favorite hobby is diving, you know, scuba diving, you know, getting on the water, you know, getting with my buddies. I'm trying to get them all to get certified so we all go together now, because usually it was just me and my dad and my brothers, and now everyone's so busy, so I gotta get my friends now involved. So scuba diving, you know? Uh, I've shared that with you guys before, seen some of my stuff, and hopefully I'll share some more with you. But yeah, I love the scuba dive. That was great. Do I like traveling? Oh, I love traveling. Uh, I've been traveling quite a bit lately. I just got back from Cabo, uh, Mexico City, and Tulum. Before that, the Dominican Republic. Uh, before that, I was in South Carolina visiting a buddy. I just don't like to stay put. I was in New Hampshire, New York earlier, and you know this year. I don't like to stay put. I like to move around. I like to go do things. I think a bucket list trip for me coming up soon is Hawaii. I want to do that. Um, I want to do what else? I don't know. I want. I, I, actually, my number one trip I want to do when the world opens up is go to Germany. My family's from Germany, my grandma's from Germany. Uh, I want her to show me the ropes of Germany. So once you know, the world opens back up, my goal is to take her to Germany with me and have her show me the world. She's the funnest lady ever. So if I do, I'll bring a camera and record her the whole time. Ah, oh, shit, I got a drink. <laughs> do I like sports? I love sports. Uh, Go team. No, I, uh, my favorite sport is basketball. Everyone's probably gonna think it's football because I play football, but every football player wants to be a basketball player and every basketball player thinks they can be a football player. And uh, so I always thought I could be a basketball player. Um, you know, I played through high school. The first time I ever played uh, varsity basketball, 30 seconds in, I got in a brawl, started a whole, huge fight, got ejected, got suspended for six weeks. Uh, but my dad was proud of me, so that was cool. But uh, I love basketball, it's my, it's my passion. I still try and play like every week. But uh, yeah, that's my sport, and I'm a Lakers fan. Go LeBron. I follow LeBron. Everywhere he goes, I'm a fan of. So, cheers to LeBron. The greatest player of all time. Better than Jordan, better than Kobe, better than everyone. Put some respect on his name. What is my favorite drink? All right. I love tequila, I love gin, and I love wine. The reason why I like tequila is because that gets me the most loose, most fun, most dancing, most vibing. The reason why I like gin is because when I drink gin, no one else likes gin, so no one's drinking off my drink. The reason why I like wine is because it's like a nice chill, like have it at dinner, a little bit romantic, you know, get the feels out. So yeah, that's, that's, how I, that's how I roll. Wine, tequila, gin, and Civil Society Brew Dog. Do I like cooking? Yes, I like to cook. Um, I should cook more than I do. Um, but I like to cook, love to grill, love to do steaks, all that stuff. But I just got into doing like these pasta dishes. I did this mushroom one with a balsamic glaze the other day. It was hitting, but I did it with like raviolis. It needed a risotto. So I gotta learn how to make risotto, and then I'm gonna have the best dish ever. And I'll probably make it at an Italian restaurant and start my own company. Do I believe in karma? Yes. Uh, my dad always told me, uh, you know, you do for someone, it'll come back to you 10 times, you know? Do good on someone. <laughs> we got F Do I do, <laughs> do I believe in karma? <laughs> ah, it's like 10.30 and I'm up. Uh, do I believe in karma? <laughs> yeah, I believe in karma. My dad always told me that if you, uh, if you do good, good by somebody, it'll come back 10 times for you. Something I always kind of live by. Uh, but in general, just do good. Be good to people, take care of people, and you feel better about yourself. Who cares about if karma's real or not? Just be good to the world, the world will be good to you. That's all. Ah, drink. <laughs> <laughs> well, I believe in destiny. Yeah, of course. I mean, why not? Why shouldn't we? Uh, I believe that, you know, everything happens for a reason. Uh, every no is, a, is, a, is another yes. You know, you just gotta keep going. You know, and you're gonna end up where you're supposed to be. And that's destiny, you know? Hopefully, for me, that is coaching football and being a dad and having a family and all that stuff. That's what destiny means to me. So, yeah, I believe in destiny and yeah, I dream for it and I want it. So, I believe. Drinking to destiny. Cheers to destiny, to being a dad, to being a coach, to having a wife. I gotta chill.
My favorite season of the year is summer. People don't come to Jupiter for summer. They, you know, they come for the winter because it's like season for all like the snowbirds. But I love summer down here the best. It's a little slower, but it's hot. And I love the heat and it makes the boat days even better. So summer for me is the best because I'm always on the water. The water's blue, the ocean is completely flat. Literally, the ocean's like a lake sometimes, it's crazy. So a lot of diving, a lot of fishing, you know, a lot of trips to the Bahamas, hopefully this summer. So for me, I look forward to the summers in Jupiter all the time. Train. <laughs>
cherish them again and they really understand them because without that, without those moments, we wouldn't be where we are today. And that's why we gotta live, you know, really be present in the moment we are in right now. And that's real. I drink to that. Love you, mama. What do I see in my future? Um, my future consists of uh, owning a construction company, consists of finding my wife, having kids, uh, being a football coach, and focusing on my family, you know? To me, family is everything. I can care less about all this, you know, like the, that's why I'm like, that's why I'm back in Jupiter. I don't care to be in LA, I don't care to be in New York. I care to be with my family. I care to build a family. That's why I'm here. That's why I want to build a career like, like, I want to do construction so badly because I want to have something that I can always do and always grow and always learn from. And that's what construction is to me. So I'm excited to get that going because uh, I know that's the next step to finding my next goal, which is finding my wife and then finding my, you know, having my kids and all that stuff. It all comes together, you know? So those are my goals, you know, and that's the, what the future holds for me. So, you know, I'm, I'm ready to get to work. Time to start digging holes and building houses. Time to drink. <coughs> Chapal just went off. And then there was three. Oh, man. Favorite cartoon? Hell yeah, I did. So I used to get out of school at like 4.30, right? The bus, Miss Mitchell would drop me off, my bus driver. I had to sit next to her every day because the first day I was over on the bus in sixth grade, I was sat in the back, I got in trouble, and I had to sit in the front for the next three years. I was a bad kid in middle school. And uh, so Miss Mitchell would drop me off, I hop on my bike, I leave my bike at the local beer shop right at, right at the end of the street, then I race home and I watch the show Recess. If any of y'all watch Recess, it's the best show ever. Like I would, I would sit there, that was the first hour of my day at home was just watching Recess. It's, tuning in, you know? So uh, Recess is definitely my favorite cartoon. I really don't like any other cartoon but Recess. So here's the Recess. Um, I live in the city and I live in the suburbs. I live in Lower East Side, uh, Two Bridges area. I live in Jupiter, Florida. I love the city. The city is my favorite place probably in the world. Uh, but do I find it uh, conducive to have a family? Is conducive even the right word? Yeah, conducive is the right word. Uh, do I find it even conducive to have a family? Not so much. Uh, I love the heat, I love the sun, I love being outside, I love playing, I love being in the water. So I think I'd probably be a suburb kid in Jupiter, you know, but uh, I'm grateful for my time spent in New York City. I love that place. It'll always be like a, a second home to me and I'll be back there again. But uh, I'm a burbs kid, I'm a suburban kid as Kodak says. And, uh, and yeah, so I'm a Jupiter boy. To the burbs, man, to the burbs. Do I have a pet peeve? <laughs> my my, my uh, high school football coach always used to say, uh, he would stand up, right? I don't know why he did this. I love him though. He would stand up and he, and he would like show, he, so he, imagine, imagine he's standing up, right? He's like, a fire this, these are his legs. And he'd be like, a fire this tall will still burn my ass. And that was him talking about pet peeves. I never understood it, but I get it though, because like, you know, the smoke, the inhalation, the heat, all that shit. So yeah, a fire that a fire this tall that burns my ass, aka a pet peeve, is when I call you and you text me back saying what's up. No, I'm calling you because I want to talk to you and, and hash it out, figure out whatever we have to talk about. I don't want to text you. So yeah, don't call me or don't text me back, call me. And to that, let's wrap this thing up. Cheers to spending 21 questions with you guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Answer these questions in the comment section. I wanna hear what you think are all the replies to your 21 questions. Uh, I appreciate you all watching. I'm gonna need a nap here in a second. Cheers, have a beautiful day. Love y'all. Let's go. Let's go. Ah.